What's up guys, it is Jonathan with One Big Impact. So we're going to make low carb French toast. And I'll be honest, I don't even know how the hell to make regular French toast. So this will be interesting. First of all, I'm just using what I would consider common sense to be able to make this. I get a pan, I got some low carb bread. This bread is actually only one net carb and only 30 calories per slice. That is amazing. They are definitely stepping it up. Slightly greasy pan for the second time. You got an egg inside a bowl. Shake it up, shake it up, stir it up. Do whatever the hell you want to it. Okay. We got our little thing here thing dingy. Make sure there ain't no ends on it. I do like the ends though. Tell you what. Tell you what. Get it on there. Make sure it's all on there. Slap it on there. Make sure you don't leave it on there too long. Looks like we're going to need another egg. So we're going to grab another egg. Probably could have made it with just one, but it might have been a little dry. You don't want no dry ass French toast, woman. Damn it. Alright. The other things that I got, I'm trying out a new one because I went to Sprouts and we all know Sprouts is ridiculously expensive. So I'm trying this little grass fed grassland non-gmo salted butter i put my tongue in there those little tongue mark whatever that's for me <laughs> not from some random person and it's actually pretty damn good i would recommend probably not getting unsalted butter it tastes like ass and then we we got pancake syrup walden farms Test. Just flip this sucker over. Probably gonna do one more. I've never ever in my life made French toast. So I'll be completely honest. I'm trying to make it lowish calories. You could probably douse the hell out of it and really go crazy with it, but I'm just trying to make like something that is a treat but also completely acceptable. So if you see that maybe you use more usually that's fine go on and get you some but I'm gonna put the macros in the description below so you can kind of see what that consists of I'm gonna let that soak in there for a minute soaking it up and this probably won't be long Leave it up there for a minute. Looks like I probably could have got it a little bit more wet on there. But that's okay. Honestly, I like it. I'm trying to make it healthy as well, you know what I mean, Ryan? This one's going to look a little bit more fry -y, Like egg-ish. That one's pretty soupy. So that's about one and a half egg. I still got some sh shiznit in there. We're gonna dump that out and I'm not gonna use it. That sounds crazy, but I'm actually trying to drop a few pounds before the competition. So making sure I don't get too crazy. And as you can see, that's what it looks like there, which is fine. Probably could have toasted it a little bit longer. Maybe you know some tips and tricks, that's fine. Put them in the comment section below. Hell is that? Something crazy, you see that? All right. The butter is actually just for the top of it, okay? I'm not actually going to be putting anything else in there. Maybe you do it with butter, I don't know. You could tell us. 
Holy crap, that smells good. That smells really good. Wow. Sometimes with Walden Farms, it's hit or miss. Okay, that one looks better. So with a little bit more egg, it looks a little bit better. So that could have been, I could have put two eggs in there and then doused this one a little bit more. One thing I think a lot of people don't take into consideration that you probably really got to be careful with is just because it's low carb doesn't mean go crazy. Low carb means high fat, means could be very, very high in calories if you're not careful. So you got to keep that shit in check. As it stands right now, we got two, two uh, eggs, well, one and a half eggs, so about 100 calories. Um, two of these breads, that's 160 calories. Uh, one tablespoon of butter, that's 260 calories. So a 260 calorie little snacky type breakfast or whatever, I don't think that's bad. That ain't bad, right? So, we are done with that. And there's no calories in the Walden Farms and less than one carb. So I'm gonna pour a little bit on there. Right there. It says I was supposed to shake that. I forgot about that. That's okay. I'm gonna put that right there. And now I'm gonna get my butter. I am weighing it by the way. Or not weighing it, but like, you know what I mean? Measuring it. Ooh, damn, that looks like some good butter. I weighed it, so shut your mouth. Okay. Alright, that's enough of that. You need to calm that ass down. That is some good butter, actually. You know what I noticed when you go low carb? <laughs> you should be putting butter in your mouth randomly. What the hell? Why are you doing that? Alright. Now we're going to drop a little bit more on here. Boom. 260 calorie low carb French toast. I ain't never even done that. Never Googled that. I'm about to eat the shit out of it though. I'll let you know what it tastes like in the comments below. See you later. I had to give you an honest review. So I'm about to take my first bite. Why did they ever put carbs in freaking French toast? Tastes just like it. What the hell? You gotta try that.